What is up guys? So today um, we have a collaboration or a collab video with Voltrix and yeah I've been waiting to do this for quite a while and we actually finally got down to it uh, yesterday which was awesome. So yeah, um, props to him, he has a really good YouTube channel, I think he has like 3,700 subscribers at this point, uh, pretty insane to be honest, um, he's doing really well on YouTube and he, get, he gets mad views as well. Um, but anyway, let's jump in straight into the gameplay and we started on Offside because I think Offside is just like um, the starting map for like most tourneys and stuff. Uh, I think Wattle Resorts um, is one as well, um, but, but not really so much. Uh, I, I like starting on Offside. And um, the loser, of course, picks the map. Uh, and I didn't show you. You'll see the games. Um, you'll see. You'll see how many games there are after this. If it if it was like a, a like I won both of them, he won both of them, or it went to a three. Um, you'll see that after I quit this battles uh, TV match. Um, and it, it was a really actually no, I'm not. I know what I can do. I can edit that out. And yeah, okay. So I can record the commentary different uh, differently to normal. And get rid of that bit so you don't know how many games it went to. If like I won uh, two first, he won um, two. Because we're doing a best of three, so if you win two, then it's over. Uh, but yeah, so farm farm size. He sold he sold his triple dart there, um, which was a tad greedy, I guess. But it's kind of paid off because he actually has more dart monkeys up than me at this point. Uh, and you can see my farms aren't quite as good. And he sends blacks just as I was going to upgrade that farm. So, for some reason, I get a spiker pulse. Complete waste of money, did not need it. And then I layer some yellows on top of some greens, and uh, it, it, he gets another triple dart up. And, well, Battles TV flashed there like he lost lives. He didn't lose any lives. Uh, he handled that pretty well with the uh, with the three triple darts and the spiker pulse. And yeah, we're equal in farms right now. I have a bit more eco, to be honest. Um, and I'm also up in money, um, but he went boomer. So, um, basically, I have to tell you this now. It, it, this was kind of unfair because I, we didn't decide that we no one um, told each other like are you allowed to go for four thousand or not? We just we didn't decide it before the game started. So um, Voltrex fairly assumed um, that four thousand were <laughs> were allowed. Um, so yeah, that kind of gave him an, uh, him an advantage because I didn't know. Uh, but anyway, so he leaks a ton to those camo zebras. He did not see the camos at all. And they just snuck right past his defense. Um, so <laughs> I thought that was GG there. I think he, I thought he would have died there. Uh, I, sh I should have sent more camos behind it. He would have killed him with the with the camo rainbows and such. But yeah, you can see I have a massive eco advantage. But he has an extra farm up than me. But I have more defense. Actually, no, he has more defense. He, yeah, forget that. He has he has the Barnet Boomer. Um, but yeah, he sends me a few regen leads. Um, I overreact. Oh, he sends some region rainbows after it. And you can see that was a pretty good rush, but my triple dark monkeys deal with it pretty well. So I got five up right now, plus two spike bolts with the boost. He definitely should have sent me a re-rush, but I got the operation dark storm up, and that would have dealt with him fine. And now you can see he is up quite a bit on farms. He is definitely up on farms. Uh, he does have more money than me at this point. And but I have a much better defense more ups. And you can see He's, he's not sending me a mob, uh, so I boost the mob at him with some uh, leads behind it to get in the way of the triple diamonds. He boosts, but he does not get the turbo charge up in time. Look at this. And the Moab sneaks. You can see his boomer was on last. If his boomer was not on last um, for the targeting, he would have survived that. He would have actually um, survived that, but no, he didn't. So he died to that rush. Uh, also, I need to follow him. So yeah, that, that was GG. I'm going to jump into the second game to stop the recording for a moment. So you don't see like spoilers or anything. So that'd be pretty cool. So yeah, see you in the next game. Welcome back to the second game. And as you can see with the fourth towers. So I got boat for my fourth tower. I didn't think I could use it. So I didn't use it at all. Uh, it's not really a spoiler. And well, you'll see. Chipper was Voltrix's fourth tower. And um, well, <laughs> you'll see what happens in this game. It is pretty funny. So yeah, I'm one up at the moment, so it's, it's it's looking pretty good for me at the moment because also I should like, is it is it is it bad to like your own battles TV? I, I don't really care. But yeah, so we both go for the triple darts. I send some reds, kind of um, putting a little bit of pressure on his uh, triple darts, so he has to get another one up, and he does indeed get another one up. Uh, he he sends me some blues, and then um, he layers some. He layers some pinks boosted, 
So I get up uh, another triple dart straight away. Pardon me, I had hiccups. Weird. So yeah, I get a, a triple dart up straight away, as does he, and we're hardly going to leak any lives. Uh, and in fact, I'm up by one life right now. Uh, I also have a lot more eco, um, because I went for those reds, so he gets his farm up slightly quicker than me. Uh, and honestly, that, that very slight eco advantage won't mean anything. It, it really won't. And we're both down one bloom boost. So right now, it is looking like he's doing it very slightly better because he got his plantation before. Uh, so yeah, he, he's playing pretty well now. He's, he's slightly ahead of me in farms, ever so slightly. Ever so slightly. And um, you can see this when he gets his next plantation. Uh, but yeah, I sent some yellows at him. Just, I sent a tiny bit of yellows. And he gets his spike pole up. So now I'm looking like I'm ahead because I can go for my second plantation. And I have more money because he went for the spike pole. So yeah, he goes for some region whites uh, and some yellows. And basically, I just, I don't, instead of getting a spike pole, I just get some triple darts. Uh, because I wasn't like ready to get my spike pole, uh, spike pole up. And you can see here, uh, he gets his chipper. And I, I was like, oh, he brought dart from chipper. Interesting, okay. Um fine by me and <laughs> I face farmed because you wouldn't see it on Battle TV but I region led my, my jug just didn't target it and it just went through and it lost me like 50, 30 lives which sucked but yeah round 13 I'm slightly ahead in farms because he was saving up some money I go for some zebras which he absolutely crushes um he absolutely crushes that with no boost whatsoever so that was a waste of money definitely and you can see he's saving up a bit of money before he goes for his farms uh, you can see he saves up like 500 before he goes for his farms, just in case that's an end of rush, which is pretty good play by him. Um, I have two spike pulps plus a jug, and so yeah, that, that's, a, that's a pretty decent defense um, for those region balloons. I'm just going to speed up this part because not, nothing really inter uh, interesting happens, it's just farming and trying to stay ahead in farms, etc. Um, but it's round 18 coming up soon. Um, so uh, on round 18 you can send a Moab and uh, like ceramics, but he has the chipper So there's n there's no point sending a Moab whatsoever because he, he just chipper it uh, So that that was kind of unfair about the fourth powers uh, But we, oh, I can't be bothered. Well, we, we decided not to redo it But yeah, he goes for a Moab uh, against me and with some legs behind and a, cam a camo ceramic uh, So I boost it straight away and I have lots of triple darts um, in my defense and the camera, I have camera detection as well, so I deal with that absolutely fine, uh, no problem. The leads are slightly troublesome because this jug spot was pretty poor for the AI. I end up getting a jug here, um, you know, just to deal with all that. So, I send a BFB, and the BFB, well, you'll see what happens, because he'll have to sell. You, you can see he only has $13,000, so he has to sell some farms to get it. And, um, well, you can see he leaks a tiny, well, yeah, he leaks a tiny bit to the AI there. I actually thought he'd die. But, yeah, so he sells the farm, gets Super Monkey Fan Club up, deals with it absolutely fine. It kind of, it, um, Battles TV kind of made it out to be easier, uh, easier defense than it was. Because I saw cer uh, some ceramics getting here and almost leaking through on that BFB. So, I actually thought he was going to die there. But I go for my BA, uh, BIA before him. Uh, right now, he has, uh, well, I have, I, I think I have a tiny bit more money. Though he has that eco advantage. As you know, uh, because I've invested a lot on my defense and got an extra jug and some extra darts and stuff, I'm actually slightly down on the money. Um, but not by much. We're like 600 apart, which is really, really not much at all. Right, okay, so. Uh, round 24, you can send, you can start sending a Zone My God, uh, which is a pretty beefy rush. Uh, I also wish they had uh, like a, a bar, like on YouTube, where you can skip through Battles TV if it starts to get boring. I really think that should be a feature. But yeah, uh, Boltrix sends some regen leads, but it doesn't do anything because I have, well, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I have 11 triple darts and 3 jugs. But yeah, I, I, I messed it up. I was meant to send regen leads, but I sent camo leads, but I got him to energy anyway. So yeah, that was pretty sweet. So we get him to use up that energy. So now we're equal in energies. That was very stupid of me. If I sent regen leads, it would have done more. Um... But I accidentally had camo on from... I don't even know why I had camo on, but I, but I did. I did. Okay, so he's going to go for the... He, he goes for the Republic, so we're virtually equal, and apparently connection's broken. Fair enough. Um, yeah, that actually... Yeah, his connection broke a few times. It's probably his phone glitching, uh, you know, the screen glitching or something. But you can see these jugs absolutely crushing uh, the regen balloons. But on his side, uh, he, because he has Chipper, 
they got it kind of regen farms a bit. But yeah, he took the balance out of his bank and he gets he gets the farm up, he gets the factory up before me. And you can see he's got the more expensive um bananas on that. And because he has chipper, he can deal with the mobs easily. But he's super monkey fan clubs. I think he could have dealt with it without doing that. But yeah, fair enough. So right here, I was kind of worried on this round that I'd die to the AI, because my jugs were not doing the best job. Um, but yeah, I, in the end, I did get the job done, and it was fine. It looked more troublesome on his side, to be honest. And yeah, you can deal with a... Uh, he actually has Super Monkey Fan Clubs, that single um, mob. But yeah, I sent a oh my god. I sent a oh my god, I get my factory. I sent a oh my god, because at this point, I thought he didn't have Ace. I didn't know he had Ace. So that is that is kind of where the unfairness comes in because I probably would, I probably would have been up by 10k and still have all that eco. So it was kind of like that was unfair because I didn't realise he had ace, um, and I didn't realise four towers were allowed. But yeah, so he defends that absolutely fine because he has ace. Um, so you can you can see me uh, spamming that emoji because honestly, I I kind of thought that was a bit a bit bad because. Now, I, I know we didn't, I guess we didn't, uh, we should have discussed it beforehand. Um, but yeah, his connection breaks, uh, breaks again. But yeah, um, so basically, well, uh, I'm outfarmed now severely. Uh, and oh god, so look at this, look at these ceramics. Look at those ceramics, I leak some lives, but I defend. But, why did I not get a spectre up? Look at this, my Super Monkey fan club runs out. And I die. And I boost too late, and I die. Which is absolute rubbish, because I had that game in the bag. Um, but I sent it as, oh my god. So I didn't realise he had ace. Uh, but yeah, that was that was really annoying. I was so <laughs> I was so annoyed with that game. So yeah, see you in the last game. Right, so the last game was on Yin Yang, uh, simply because this is one of this is my favourite map. Like, I'm pretty good on this map. Um but yeah, so for, uh, by now, I know that 4th powers were allowed, uh, but I got Tack. He got Ace. Like, is that fair? <laughs> but yeah, that's why I, I, I should have, we should have discussed it. So yeah, it's completely fine. I don't mind. Um, but yeah, so Decider. It, I, I'm going to like this as well. But yeah, it was the Decider. So me versus Voltrix, the final. Who, who, uh, I'm going to put a poll. Who do you think will win from this Decider? Do you think Voltrix... Um, the CC player legend, <laughs> or um, me, well, you you'll see uh, very soon. So, basically, uh, I kept sending pinks because just look at this, Voltrix doesn't get anything up, he just, he just li tanks these pinks, and it gets him down to less than seven, uh, less than half his lives just by sending um, a few pinks. So, I think Voltrix should have got another boat up. Uh, to defend those, because getting that low on lives that quickly is not good. Uh, you need to be up on lives more than that. Uh, but yeah. Okay, so we're equal in farms. Everything's pretty equal. I get my wizard up, just in case he sends yellows. I don't want to be caught on by surprise. Um, uh, and we go for our plantations at exactly the same time. I have a tiny bit more money, because he's upgraded his boats a lot more than me, so I can start out farming him, uh, which is nice. So yeah, I, de I de out farm him. I go for a few region leads. But honestly, they didn't do much because they went. He went for the lightning wizard, and the lightning wizard's very OP. Uh, he he then sends some regen uh, zebras, regen whites, and all sorts of stuff. And well, you can see, um, I deal with that fine. I get the destroyer off. I sell a farm just because I didn't want to boost before round 13. But then I send, I send um, the, I send the rainbows and the zebras, but it doesn't do anything because his light he boosted. His lightning wizard absolutely crushed that rush. So yeah, props to him. That was a pretty de decent defense, actually. I didn't think that would do that well. Um, I, I just show I have tack, just to show my tower, uh, so I can maelstrom. Because if he sent me some region leads, it would cost me to sell a farm to get the maelstrom up. So I just showed him my habit, so it was kind of going to put him off rushing me, I guess. So um, right now, things are looking not great for me. But then he, <laughs> he gets the fire mage up. And I'm just like, what? Why? You, you were, Voltrix is probably listening to this right now. You were up in farms right there. Like, you didn't have to get that extra defense. But we both, okay, this is where it gets intense. We both sent a Moab. And we both boosted at each other. And look what happens. Okay, so, basically, I'm going to Tornado Mage it. 
and I knew my destroyers could handle it, but look at this. So he was, look, look how close this goes. So he boosts there. He was legit. Look at this. The fight, look at the Tornado Mage. On the, on the Battles TV screen, the Tornado Mage, uh, the Tornado Mage, um, uh, the Tornado Mage, uh, it, look, it hit the balloons on Battles TV. But in the game, it missed them completely and shot in the other way, which is absolute rubbish. So, you could see there, the, torn uh, the Tornado Mage actually threw them back and I would have survived without the boost. And then I would have re-rushed him and he maybe would have died. But no, but the Tornado Mage decides to be completely dumb and it doesn't fire the ceramics, so I lose. Um, so yeah, that, that was the best of three. I really hope you enjoyed. I was so, uh, so annoyed about that last game. I'm, I am not gonna lie. I was very annoyed. Uh, but I, I said we could post it anyway. He offered not to, uh, but I did it anyway. Uh, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed. Uh, more collabs with Curly and Voltrix, hopefully in the future. And see you in the next one.